Yes, it's S SBC Ridge 2000. And Merry Christmas to all of you watching this video. And uh, look what I got for Christmas. It's a Midland WR120. Man, it's cool. All right. So this Midland WR120 with with tow and same alert system make a great addition to my collection. So Merry Christmas to all of you watching this, and um, I'm just gonna unbox it. Uh, all right, I got it. Oh, all right then. I got to do this with one hand. Yeah. So I asked for this for Christmas, and I fear. And I'm really happy that I got it. I gotta find a way to set this down. <laughs> uh, let me just park it over here. Let me put it here and right there. You just yeah, clam packaging is actually a lot harder to actually open than than the regular packaging. Uh, is that enough? Yeah, that's enough. Uh. Yeah, that's enough. Clam packaging is always harder. Okay, so let's see. Alright. Wow. This is really nice. Yep. So, what the, what the heck? Oh. <laughs> Alright. You know, as mentioned by SBC Cranford, and all... The tradition in the ES committee is that you press all the buttons, switches, yeah, before you do anything. So what I want to do is peel this off. Hmm, where did I put this? You know what? I'm going to stick it to my window. Oh well, it's not perfect, but what can you do? <laughs> and there's also a battery supply inside so so let me just see if I can reach the battery and it's on the other side yeah I'm doing this with one hand because I don't have a tripod it stinks but what can you do oh. yeah let me just put this down again just so I can um, see just need to unwrap this yeah actually what's cool is that Christmas falls on a Wednesday this year so I get to um, this Midland gets to be put to the test by the um, required weekly test just plug this in did I press all the buttons already okay good now where's the power button yeah yeah What's cool is the Midland is that actually it has a hook, so where to put it as, put it to the power. Oh wow, very nice. Welcome. Set language. Okay, let's see. Um, set language. Hang on, I gotta refocus. Yeah. English select. Sorry you can't see this well, but set. Let me put it somewhere where there's no light. Let me see. And there we go, that's better. Set look at any. There we go. Set time. Okay. What time is it? Well, my radio shack over there says 9.37, so... And that's ahead by like five minutes, so... Let's see. 9... Alright, 37, so... Yeah, I like to set it like um I had a few minutes because like every time I like take out the battery it's like it messes it up. Set channel. Alright for this. Let me extend the antenna all the way. All the way. Whoops, what the heck? Alright, I'm gonna have to put this down. There. That is actually a long antenna. Alright, so let me put it over here. Set channel. Alright, this is catch 28. This is WXM30, WXM60 Southern. Oh, and I'm gonna. WNG704 from Hibernia Park. I can also pick up WXL39 from Allentown, Pennsylvania. Oh, 
I can also pick up KW035, which by the way is still off due to the interference problems. There's nothing on channel 6, and I can pick up KCC31. I think for the required weekly test, I'm gonna do KCC31. There. Setup done. It says there, see? Right here. Setup done. Alright. So here, for the menu, set alarm, set line. Uh, sorry about this, guys. It's just. I can't seem to find a spot. Set location. Let me just. Set location. Um, alert type. Voice. I want like the voice. That's so much better. Alert test. Oh. That's loud, actually. Set channel. Already did that. Backlight. Now you can do normal. On or off. I think I'm going to do it normal just so it doesn't like drain too much battery. Button beeps on, we like it on. Now set events. All default. All default, all default, all edit events. Everything is on. There we go. Set time, set alarm, set language. Yeah. Let me just double check something for this one. Let me check the um set events because um so I can do edit the events. I'm just gonna go to the um yep. How do I know that this is on? On yeah. Child abduction, coastal flood, coastal flood warning, on, on, on. Now let me skip to the um wow. This is a long list actually. <laughs> I'm just skipping to the um Hurricane Watch. See, you can't toggle with Hurricane Warning, I think. Yeah, you can't toggle with that. You can... Let me check the required weekly test. Yeah, so I can find out if it's gonna... Here, required weekly test. On. There we go. Required monthly test. Alright. Good. Let me just, for the safety, just put it on on. Yep. This is a cool radio, actually. All default, all off. Alright. And it looks like I'm good to go. Hey, honey. Highs in the mid-40s. Saturday night. Mostly clear. And actually, let me show you something while I'm doing that. The required weekly test happens today, and that'll be its own video. It's 940 right now. Now, let me actually show you something with the radio shack that I did this Christmas. I gave it a little hat. <laughs> uh. around 50. I love it. Yeah, so all three of these radios are going to be featured in today's required weekly test. Merry Christmas, everybody. And, and, um, I guess so. And the next, actually, another one of required weekly tests is on New Year's Day itself. So, see you guys.